Omnibus allows you to easily reference your immersive mixes with only a few simple steps. Firstly, you'll need to select your max audio output as Omnibus A. Now let's go to Audio MIDI Setup and go into our Omnibus drivers and edit our speaker configurations. In Omnibus A in Audio MIDI Setup to 714 Atmos Surround. Now if we move down, we can adjust our speaker channels to be from 1 through 12 for the Omnibus A driver. Meaning now when you play a 714 mix from Apple Music, it'll play out channels 1 through 12 from Omnibus A. Now repeat these steps for Omnibus B. Let's now head into Apple Music and go into Preferences, Playback and move down to Dolby Atmos. Make sure you have Automatic selected to allow immersive audio playback through Omnibus. Navigate to your Sessions Audio settings and select Omnibus B as your playback engine. This means your door will now be travelling through a separate Omnibus driver than Apple Music. In the Omnibus routing matrix, you can route channels 1 through 12 to your designated output channels 1 through 12. You'll then need to save this as a snapshot for later. Let's now clear our routing configuration in settings and repeat these steps for Omnibus A but with Omnibus B this time. So we'll route channels 1 through 12 from Omnibus B to our designated outputs 1 through 12. Now let's save another snapshot of this. You'll see now when we toggle between these two snapshots, but our routing configuration will toggle between Omnibus A being outputted and Omnibus B being outputted. Now, if you loop your immersive mix or master you are working on and loop an immersive track from Apple Music you wish to reference, you can toggle between the two snapshots you've created to reference your mix to any previously released immersive audio content. To get your free demo of Omnibus, head to audiomovers.com.